Okay. Good voice. Okay. Um, new Smash Direct is happening. I just woke up, forgot about this, and I checked. <laughs> I checked my sub box, and said, "And the rest, Smash Nintendo Direct reaction." I was like, "Oh," and like, "Oh," and then I saw. I saw one thing. I'm like, "No!" So, I didn't see any of the leaks. I always stay away from Smash leaks. I'm a good boy and I only saw one thing <laughs> god damn it Shofu but um, all right, I'm gonna tell you but I'm saying like okay let's just say minor spoiler when I say this you're already gonna know what it's gonna be at least I think so unless there's someone else that fits that description which would be weird but, um, spoilers in three, two, one, minor. Three, two, one it involves a plant. So I saw that. <laughs> so, bro, if Waluigi is in this, I'm gonna be so triggered. <laughs> I'm gonna be so fucking triggered. <laughs> if he, if what I just described gets in before Waluigi, I am actually gonna shit a fucking brick. I'm actually gonna shed a break. All right, let's just do this. Let's just do this. Hopefully, everything is fine. I don't know. I won't really know. At least you should. Thing you want to get out was at least my voice. I mean, you can like sync it up with Nintendo Direct. And for some reason, if it does go out, I'm gonna uh, create a countdown. I'm gonna start at three on go. Three, two, one, go. Okay, this is only Smash 2. I'm, I'm excited. I'm kind of tired, but I'm good. <sighs> Smash Bros. Oh, hopefully it's not too loud. November 1st, baby. Hello, this is Masahiro Sakurai. Daddy. Sora Limited. Daddy this Sakurai. This is the final Nintendo Direct before the launch of Super Ooh, Smash Bros. Oh, final one, eh, boys? So far, we've confirmed 72 fighters. Oh, wow, 74 dude. if you count Pokemon Trainer as three. Our entire team has worked really Jesus. hard. With this Nintendo Direct, <laughs> is we'll have every new every fighter you can find in the game. Okay, let's do this. Every new fighter. All right, let's go. We're going to start with an with no raid already? We are. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Okay, show me. Eh? Oh, they don't like it. Oh, this. Oh, this looks cool as fuck. Wait. Is that Ken? Alright. <laughs> Alright. It's like good Ken too. Good design Ken. Is that another one? Oh my god. Alright, so it's an echo fighter. Makes sense. You can smash though. Oh, he's got the. That's like. That's his V trigger, isn't it? Nani? I don't know that. Oh, 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 it's in Oh, I didn't expect another Pokemon. Are they all wrestlers? Is it happening, boys? Yeah, complete new fighter in Cinnamon. Wow, okay. He is who I picked. I picked Blitton. First playthrough. That's pretty cool. I guess. I don't know. It makes sense for him to be in, I guess. He is a wrestler. <laughs> he isn't fighting type, though. He's fighting back. What? Oh. Oh, it all comes dead, dude.
direct is 40 minutes, by the way. Jesus. Can they already putting them in the thing? Ken Cinnaroar. Wow, immediately. What the f- what is- what else is it gonna announce? Cause this is 40 minutes. Ryu's rival from Street Fighter series. Street Fighter series, Ryu's rival Ken joins as an Echo Fighter. In his original game, Ken could be considered Ryu's Echo Fighter. Though perhaps you could say Luigi is the original Echo Fighter. But let's get back to Ken. Ken has been distinguished from Ryu over the years, but the Ken you'll see this time is based on Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo. Here's how he'll differ from Ryu. His heavy Shoryuken turns up the heat. Nice. It's got a fire Shoryuken. The shape of his Hadouken is different too. And his Tatsumaki Senpu Deku strikes opponents multiple times. Hell Wheel. Focus Attack. It's all about the kicks. Lots of Ken's signature moves, such yeah. as his famous kicks, which change based on your command inputs. He's a bit faster than Ryu, and we've also incorporated right. other tweaks from recent titles. Just like Ryu, he has two final smashes. Nice. First, the spinning uppercut, Shin Ryuken. We've made it look flashy as it is in the Versus series. Execute a final smash near an opponent, and you'll instead perform a Shiklu Jin Raikyaka. Incineroar joins the battle. Now for our last new challenger, Incineroar. The last new challenger? I think that's a line 10 though. It mainly uses pro wrestling moves, and as such, its throws are a bit more powerful. Like <laughs> I think it's a lie. When one of its attacks is successful, it'll pose for the audience. And they never, like, Luckily, you can cancel out of these poses at any time, so Ooh. they won't open you up to additional enemy attacks. Its neutral special is called Darkest Lariat. Oh, it was signature move. a signature move in the Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon games. Yep. Perhaps it's something of a red cyclone. Its up special is Cross Chop. Oh, damn. You'll leap up and come rocketing back down. Where's Phoenix right though? <laughs> Where's Waluigi? This attack can be very effective, but if you mess up, it's easy to self-destruct. Only one we just coming, boys. For its side special, Incineroar makes opponents run the ropes after a dash and grab. When they bounce back your way, press the button at just the right moment. If you're too early, you'll do a back body drop. Wait too long and you'll fail. Hmm. Nail the timing and you'll pull off a powerful lariat. Its down special is revenge. Counter, alright. When damaged, Incineroar's burning passion comes to the surface, powering up its next attack. That's Incineroar's idea of a counter attack. And its final smash? Max Malicious Moonsaw. It's even faster and fiercer than the Z-move it's based on. Z-move, yeah, makes sense. We base it off Z-move. We finally revealed all of the fighters you'll find in the game. This is the initial now fighter Now it's a You always end up with the fighter. Many at first, but it is and the also been spoiled as the original by the one I just game. mentioned. And once you've unlocked them all... How do you lock them though? Like this. Jesus. It may seem hard to guess where each one's located, but they're sorted by number and the order they join the series. I hope you'll enjoy battling with all 74 fighters on the roster. Amiibo. Oh boy. Of course, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. That was a really thing, wasn't it? Pretty sure that was a really thing. Ridley. They yeah, already showcased this. I can like the treehouse. And the game was announced in general. We got a wolf. Alright. Alright, wolf one is new. Level 12, 7. You may recall that we're 2019. Here's a look at the new amiibo figures. Alright. I don't get amiibos, but. Okay, let's get a few probably. We determined that collectible trophies wouldn't be a great fit for this game. Oh. Honestly, they were really difficult to develop too. <laughs> that said, the Super Smash Brothers series is one massive crossover at heart, and we want to create something more. A way to enjoy characters other than fighters Take from a look. variety of video game worlds. Eh? Here's what we came up with. They're called spirits. Nani? 
and I don't mean the spooky kind. <laughs> yes, it was Halloween. Simply, these spirit characters will lend a helping hand to your fighters, powering them up in battle. Oh, it's that guy, Chibi Robo with luck. Imagination meets reality. The oh, this is the new mode. The, series, the characters are toys in the real world, but they are fighters in the world of the logo was the same as like, or at least it's shaped the same as when they like blurred out the new, the different mode. Nation. Returning to the real world is an ongoing theme. In the imagination, yep. you can battle impossible combinations of characters. In this mysterious world, the unspeakable happens. Many beloved characters lose their physical forms. All of them, except the fighters, are turned into spirits, unable to Subspace? return to the real world. Please tell me. This is a spirit. Fighters oh, whoa. can join forces with spirits to enhance their powers. <clears throat> awesome. Zero, Jesus. Spirits. Anime. There are several classes of spirits. Oh, there's fire emblem. Of course, there is. Standard spirits are dubbed novices. Novice. Strong oh, there's... ones have the title. Oh, looks like a sticker. Especially strong face. ones are called aces, and some are in a league of their own. Legend. So it's how much is it? Kind of like the sticker thing, except more involved. To be at a time. Okay. <clears throat> a primary spirit's power will be added to the fighter who has it equipped. In some cases, these augmented fighters become extremely powerful. Multi Jesus. So it is kind of like. If a primary spirit has enough available slots, you can assign them support spirits. Alright. While primary spirits enhance fighter stats, support spirits lend them additional At skills. At least more fire emblem. Once the primary spirit <sighs> and support spirits are set, your fighters all powered up. Spear battles. The main way to acquire spirits is to win spirit or battles. Or volley. can. You'll find a variety of spirits lined up on the spirit board. Choose the one you want to battle for. When you do, you'll face off against a fighter whose abilities and personality are kind of sort of similar to the opposing spirit. In the case of the Lakitu and Spiny spirit, you'll battle against Iggy Koopa and a group of small red Bowsers. Iggy's riding high in his Koopa Clown car, of course. Here are some examples of other battles you can expect. Gordo. This is like super casual mode. Is it only single player? <laughs> Just fucking for that you. Oh, there's gotta be like five million fucking fireman characters. <laughs> the imprisoned. Oh, let's go, sorry. It's so weird. I should have did a CR search. Lip. Nani? Naval Sisters. Sianic. Makes sense. <clears throat> Nani? How? Sanctus. Is this something? No, I didn't play Metal Gear. I don't know, dude. I, I don't know a PS1, so. Metal Bill. Bo I mean, Bullet Bill. <laughs> Battle Bill. I don't want PS2 though, actually, so some games are backwards compatible. Uh, most, I think. So I should probably check up on that. Oh. Let me cue. Even if you accidentally hit the shield, the damage will carry over, so you'll have an advantage the next time you encounter that spirit. 
Guardian. Primary spirits have strength based on their type. Attack oh Attack no, yeah, it's fire emblem shit, dude. Is stronger than shield, and shield is stronger dude, that's exact that's exact same colors they use for fire emblem at fire emblem. It's sword be be axe, axe beats spear, spear beats sword. When you encounter Melia. like poison floors and slumber Melia. Floors, be sure to prep yourself with an appropriate support system. Melia. Battle conditions oh. hints before battle, so make sure it's okay, it was Melia, that'd be sick as fuck. With spirits on your side, there are all kinds of things you can do. When you fight with a primary spirit equipped, it'll level up after battle. Or you can feed it snacks. It's fucking jam. Food into his throat. Some spirits even have an enhanced form only upon leveling them up. What the fuck? You can also say that you crowd on. While you do have to say goodbye to that particular spirit, its core will stay. And by combining these cores, you can summon a new spirit. Another Fire Emblem character. <laughs> Why? What's fucking. God damn it. You can also train. <gasps> what a man fever! Fuck Lewis. Or send them off in search of treasure, which they'll bring back to you. These seem like unlikely teams of characters. It's a real man fever, but it's just Red in Heaven. General. Game Pure and Fever though. Yield results, even while playing Can't other mana. Or after turning off the game. So if you send out your spirits, just let them do their thing. So bad. Certain spirits are known as masters. Can't, 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 can't. You can beat them to unlock facilities. <laughs> spirits can also be used to power up amiibo figure players. You must bid them farewell, but you can repeat the process multiple times. Huh. It's one great big collection of characters Is another from many character? different series. Yeah, it was a pretty sure. how many would you guess there are? Oh, look at the fucking fire <laughs> Whenever you fight against the spirit, the final smash meter is enabled. Yeah, uh, okay. Some spirits can help you fill up your gauge at a faster rate. Oh, yo, she's in your final smash. It's like a stampede. It's really otherwise impossible. If Roy Nail, I would. Or Falamon. Killing and Caddy. I'm Katie. Mumka! <laughs> More fun. You saw that. There's more fun in there. Oh, okay. While assembling a team, press the Y button for a recommendation that has a type at back. More fun. The chosen spirit. The game will recommend support spirits who can help out. The wings look so. Yeah. Edley. Y for recommendation. All right. Also fight against other players who are using spirits. All right. Jesus. Given the way spirit types interact in battle, think carefully when building your team. Rudo Cutsman. Your strengths in a two-on-two -two battle. Oh, finally, okay, Jesus. You battle together with friends via local wireless, or take the fight to the world with online play. To connect two Nintendo spirits, yep. Consoles, press the DR button. Pull up the dashboard and select local wireless. No subspace, boys. There's no longer a need to separate the online modes into for fun and for glory. Instead, matchmaking is based on three factors. For rules. For online battles, you can set your preferred rules. These rules can be pre-registered so you can quickly select your favorite playstyle. Before battle, one player's preferred rules will be chosen at random, and all players will fight using those rules. You can also choose not to set any preferred rules and let the others decide instead. If possible, the matchmaking system will find players with similar preferences and link them up for a battle. Global Smash Power is being factored into matchmaking, but it's still used as an online leaderboard as well. 
A high GSP score, such as 100,000, means you've got more points than 99,999 other players. All right. Your GSP will change as the total population of players increases or you're overtaken. If you're yearning for a challenge, try increasing your global smash power so that you'll naturally end up with some more serious opponents. By the way, oh. you can set a GSP score for each fighter. Fighters you haven't used yet will be assigned a placeholder GSP based on the highest score you've set with one of the other fighters. If you repeatedly self-destruct on purpose, you can face a penalty, like being disconnected. Which is so please oh. don't do that. As with any rage quit, basically. a stable connection is very important. For this reason, the matchmaking system will prioritize shorter distances between players. Well, so no shit, that's what my strange needs to do. Please understand that we can't promise you'll always be matched accordingly. As please such, understand. We'd appreciate it if you could make your connection as stable as possible. Yeah, maybe if you. Land cable is recommended. Yeah, maybe you have an adapter. That'd be cool. But no. We came with the switch. That'd be cool. I would attach a land to it, but whatever. Once your global Ooh. smash power is high enough, you can enter elite battles. Elite. This is ranked. When you reach this level, feel free to pat yourself on the back. You're good. Period. After the game releases, we may adjust the game balance, hmm? and the team will definitely pay attention to the results of these elite battles. So yeah, it's just like kind of ranked, I guess, in a way. Everyone who plays online needs their own smash tag. Alright. Fan game. You'll receive their smash tag. But it's not like you'll lose your smash tag even if you lose a battle. You simply gain more tags as you win. Try to collect lots of smash tags. What the hell? Smitty. Lewis Jordan. You can select short messages and send them before and after battles using the directional buttons. Oh boy. Choose from a wide selection of Time to teach the skills. After you've chosen a fighter, you can enjoy other modes while you wait for the battle to begin. Right. Not every mode will be available while matchmaking runs in the background, but you can leave and enter some game modes. Training. Spectator mode. Spectator mode returns once again, so you can watch other players' battles. Maybe can you bet? Some good tips that way. Can you bet on it? You didn't say. Form a two-player team and play together online with a single Nintendo Switch system. You'll be paired up against two-player teams with the same setup. Battle Arena. When you want to play online, you can create a special type of room to fight other players. If you set the rules for one of these battle arenas, you can fight against your friends. Here, there are spots where you can join the battle, wait in line, or even spectate. Okay, so it's like a... It all depends where you place your token. Right. When you're in a battle arena, yeah, that's this fine game. Can I sit there? Ew, no. Yeah, so can you with Discord? It may become an essential tool for some players. We are also developing a free service for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, and we're naming it Smash World. Mm -hmm. Instead of focusing on Smash World, we're going to lost record. We're allowing players to post gameplay videos, watch them, and more. Once oh. the service starts, we'll offer regular updates so you can post to your heart's content. Okay, don't use YouTube when we'll copyright strike you. Next, I'd like to change topics and talk a little about the assist trophies that will support your fighters in battle. Do you know which characters come from which games? Yuri, uh -huh. <laughs> Fatal Frame, all right. Spope. Sis trophies. Isaac. Or by Isaac as a character. <clears throat> Black Knight. Oh, that's Fire Emblem. That's Fire Emblem, alright. <laughs> oh my god. The Womp? Mm -mm. 
So now make the noises. Oh. Why you leave? It's fucking why you leave? Yeah. Um. <clears throat> More Fire Emblem, yay! But I mean, why? <laughs> Vince, it's your boy Vince. Guile! Oh, confirmed, we have Gaius Steam. Confirmed. Akira, fucking virtual fighter. This is now fifty nine. Actually, they outnumber the Pokemon this time. Really? Persist trophies who can be KO'd can also be defeated by the fighter who summoned them just before they're KO'd. That way, you won't lose a point to the other player. Oh, huh. Now, I'd Dude. like to cover a variety of other features in the game. Which time have you left? If you want to review the controls oh, like, for game, 20. press the ZR button to open the dashboard and look in here. There are all kinds of helpful guides to check out. Century Smash. Century Smash may look familiar to veterans. It feels great to keep smashing enemies on the oh. screen, doesn't it? You can right. play on many different stages. It's this. You can choose the music too. In previous games, you had to unlock every fighter before playing All Star mode, but now you can play it right out of the box. The currently available fighters will appear endlessly. You can save the replay data of your battles. And now, you hmm. can create videos with it. Huh. There's also a menu where you can read those quick tips and tricks you see during loading screens. Yep. Smash 4. When right. viewing them, you can sort by category or fighter. Oh, you just do that. Okay. Complete challenges to earn rewards. Sandbag. This time, each page is sorted by category, and the layout looks more like a comic book. Oh, it's this. The smash, yeah. Okay. Enjoy. <laughs> the records menu tracks your balance. There are five different options. <laughs> Fucking snake. Raiden. Squeeze my hug. Trade in smash tags to score some in-game gold. Gold can be exchanged for music tracks, spirits, and items for spirits mode. Music tracks? If you're collecting music, I recommend visiting the shop to find the ones you want, instead of just relying on challenges. Hmm. You can enter the options menu by pressing the ZR music, button. So I'm going to do immediately. Okay, get all the music. Language support. <laughs> Oh, dude. I know this is very important to some of you. For example, the voices of Pokemon are different in several Oh languages. my god, I actually get from Japanese. <laughs> the fighter names are also specific to each language. Adiano. These options were highly requested and well worth the effort. <laughs> You got chain in there. It's cool. TV mode and handheld mode have separate settings for brightness. I can't wait until the weeps like put the shin Japanese. Just so they can hear the Japanese voices. So be sure to set both. 
The dope, the dope is trash. <laughs> All my Japanese voices. Okay. If you're fighting against a friend on the same system, you can adjust the strength of your fighters. Sometimes a player is just too good, and you want to take measures to ensure it's a fair fight. All right. If that's the case, try using this feature. When custom balance is adjusted, a symbol will be displayed. Of course, this feature is not available during wireless and online battles. Oh, Jesus. Battle. You can customize your Mii fighters and change their outfits. Yep. In addition to the voice options, there are a variety of outfits to choose from. Speaking of Mii Fighters, let me Mii Fighter! I think that's the first time I heard Sakurai's Japanese voice. His actual voice. You get clan set. Alright. Splatoon 2 set. Urban Girl set. Play game that lasted two seconds. Chibi Robo. They like Chibi Robo, don't they? They like a big Japanese. Game over there. It's fucking Nintendo lap. <laughs> Look at this nerd. What the fuck? What the? F he was controlling the. What? Anyway, there's something I should point out. As I said, we've revealed all of the fighters you can find in the game. Yep. Oh, DLC. But there are even more post launch. While we've already implemented a huge roster of So you come from DLC before the game is out. Which means we're leaving the opportunity Classic Japan fighters as paid DLC. Since we already included every fighter from the past games, that means there are no more fighters to include unless we develop new fighters from scratch. And we're not talking about echo fighters. No echo fighters. We'll be developing and selling sets that will include one fighter one stage and multiple music tracks. Uh, the price for each set is expected game? to be five ninety nine. Six bucks. At the same time, we will offer the fighters pass. Oh, there's season pass. Five fighters, five stages, and all of their music tracks. All five fighters. Let's confirm that there's five fighters. Alright, it's gonna be five DLC characters. They're not gonna be Echo Fighters. Obviously, they're not gonna be returning. Five stages, they're all going to confirm to have a stage for the music tracks. First press available as it was released, all sets will be released to the end of February 2020. And just said when they're going to like stop supporting the game. Alright. 2020, fuck. Creating something like the fire <laughs> I fuck. We should reveal what's included before it becomes available for purchase. However, please allow so us to pre the okay. This is such like little Japanese developers <laughs> doing no fun games. Kinda hate it. Wait, what are we Again, doing? The price is twenty four ninety nine for all five sets. Now that we finally confirmed the development of this DLC, oh, okay, so you don't like really hard on it. Five times f actually there's six, so you can take only do save a bit of money. I wonder if I'll ever get to take a break. By the way, here's one purchase bonus you'll get with the fighters pass. Oh, there's a purchase bonus. Oh, fuck off. No! Get Xenoblade! Get Xenoblade 2 for my shit. Tora. That was no pun. I know no puns or something. 
Be right. Fucking no. Xenoblade 2 is trash. I don't like Xenoblade 2. Just pick a video why I don't. Let's turn into a fucking weeb game. Now. Is this? Oh wait, this is—is is this the thing I was pulled on? Huh. What the fuck? Mario's pissed, dude. Mario's fucking pissed. Oh yeah, it's that. That's what. That's what I was. Is it a character or what the fuck is it? Pipes up. Is it actually a fucking character? Please don't tell me. To. I want to die. Waluigi isn't in the game, but he is. Wait, you can only get this if you fucking pre-order. I have to pre-order the game, which I'm not gonna do. That's not what's gonna happen. Cause this game comes out before Christmas, so. In Christmas is probably when I'm getting it. That's right. Piranha Plant will take root in Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Sir, can you only but as an actual fight? Can you only pre-order? Are you fucking spit poison? Fire off spiky balls. And perform long range attacks. This tricky character is full of surprises. It's final smash. Why? Piranha. If you get caught in the cage, well, let's just say it won't end well for you. Piranha Plant is scheduled. I should have just been Peter Piranha as a fucking character. Smash Brothers We've gotten a little head start on it, but it probably won't be ready. Who wants to throw one? What the fuck? Please stay tuned. Remember, Piranha Plant is a free, limited time offer. For the physical version of the game, you only need to go through the My Nintendo Gold Point registration process to receive it. I hope you'll consider pre-ordering. We're also creating the fuck? an Evo. It has a nice curved form to it. I hate this. I hate all of this. What the fuck's happening? Pre-purchase the game after finishing this Nintendo. Oh, fuck you. I hope you'll go to Nintendo eShop or Nintendo.com before you forget. I'm gonna fucking pre-order the game. We have getting the Ultimate Edition for Smash, which comes with the Nintendo Game Controller and the adapter. That bundle better have the Fighter's Pass. So I'm going to shit my fucking dick. Probably not knowing fucking Nintendo. Now they don't know how to do fucking like, good business. But we'll see. I have an announcement for everyone watching this in North right. America. <clears throat> North America. On our official site, you can find information for a variety of upcoming hands-on events. Events. Participants will have a chance to try out all 74 fighters. So you know how you North Americans like going to events. And more. I mean, there's gotta be, wait, yeah, there's events in other places. Are you insist North America? But before we go, Happen on that okay, faithful thing. I should mention that the adventure mode in this game is nothing like what we came up with for the subspace emissary. What? That said, what exactly caused all these characters to He mentioned subspace and man. I'll show you how it all begins and leave the rest to your imagination. What? So okay then. Please look forward to the game's release. He's smiling, you smug bitch. Daddy, you smug fucking daddy suck right, you smug bitch. What is it? Wait. This is not no, actual. What the f? Oh. Master. No! Oh! What? There's many Master Hand! We'll each need to take down about ten. Still, you're here. It's now or never. We'll win this. I know we will. This is like different subs. Oh. A vision! 
Oh, <laughs> shulk. Shield or some shit, dude. Shulk change the future, man. No, Shulk wasn't able to change the future. This man got a vision. That's smart. Shulk. Shulk's still into the future, bro. They look like they're being destroyed, like straight up DBZ style. They look like they're fucking dead. <laughs> I, f I swear to god, if Kirby saves this fucking Sakurai. Of course, Kirby's the only that survives fucking Sakurai. You biased ass motherfucker. <laughs> What galaxy? Where am I get? Oh, what the fuck? Money? So, I mean, there's there's gotta be a story mode, right? Is this like the new? Is this a new story mode? Maybe not like subspace, but. Oh, they actually have lyrics! The Smash! We got vocals, boys! They're English! Yes! <laughs> Yo, what the fuck is happening? What the fuck? We can't turn into a meep! <laughs> no, they can't turn into trophies. My voice is going, oh. Evil Mario. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? So isn't this is like M sixty four Smash? Like everybody just there's just the evil versions of people. It doesn't seem like it's a story. No, around as Kirby. Sure. All right. You hear this music though! Nice. I'm glad they added vocals. I'm really glad. I mean, just from here, now, I mean, you can't top Smash Bros. Brawl. World of Lights. That's kind of a story mode in a way. It's a single player mode. Alright. Ten, though. That's it, right? Yup. <laughs> Fucking damn. There it is. There's a lot. Okay, so Incineroar's new fighter. Ken, new Echo fighter. Prano Plan is a fighter if you pre order. <sighs> Some Soul Calibur sick shit right there, dude. Um, well, we do is in the game, so this game is trash. Phoenix Rise is in the game. Sora is in the game. Uh, they added Xenoblade 2 stuff. Ugh. <laughs> um, new single player mode, though. That looks fun. They talked a lot about, like, just those additional features that, like, it's not, this wasn't, you know, it wasn't as big. You know, the one in, um, August definitely was, like, the biggest one there it was the first like full smash direct um damn <laughs> um smash we got a new we got vocals for it now that's pretty cool they confirmed the fire thing and yeah yeah you're already heard what i said during it was my uh, <laughs> that's shitty i hate that People are just doing that now. They're getting away with it because it's just a thing now. And it sucks. Um, no, it's cool though. 
there's some high moments, there's some mm, moments, but I'm still, I'm still, I'm, I'm gonna, well, hopefully, <laughs> I'm gonna buy it anyway, so, I'm gonna pre-order though, so it says it's free for a limited bonus if you pre-order, so that, I'm assuming that means you gotta pay for him at some point, and hopefully he's more discounted than the other fighters, or at least he comes with a fighter pass, well, actually it says if you get it, uh, physical version. Unless you pre-order physical version, or if you just get a physical version, I should have checked up on that. I'll check up on that at some point. Um, you get a. What's I gonna say? <laughs> oh, you get a code to like redeemers or shit. Sign up for like the my gold tail bullshit. I think I'm still. Uh, I'm already on. Um. Wait, wait. Does that mean you have to? Oh, is is that saying that you can purchase him with like the the gold points, which you get basically by um uh just buying games, Nintendo games. You can earn those. Um, the way those work is a little iffy, but I'm not gonna go into that. Um. I still like the brawl thing more <laughs> after reading that. that. I mean, don't get me wrong, that was really fucking good. But the brawl thing, like, you just can't top that, dude. Brawl had some good fucking mixes. And just the music was so good. The original music was so good for that game. Fucking hell. The only good thing. <laughs> no, but there, no, there was features in brawl that I were added, and it was pretty cool. I had subspace, so that was awesome. Fortunate about the gameplay, though. But, I mean, yeah, brawl, brawl. All about snake, subspace, all that shit. So, can can this on it too much, man? It was it, it was fun. I was like, my that was the Smash game I played the most, and I had N sixty four in that one. So I guess <laughs> I skipped melee, but uh, because I didn't have a GameCube. But that's cool. And Sinor I didn't expect it anymore. <laughs> that's uh, I guess I should have expected a new Pokemon, but didn't. Um, that's cool, you Ken's there. Um, yeah, nothing really crazy big. I like the spirit thing we were showing. That was like, um, I mean, but the spirit thing, I mean, like the thing would just, they would it ended on, <laughs> they talk about spirits for a while and like 50 billion fire characters or in spirits, um, that they couldn't add. Uh, we couldn't have these characters in Smash. I would put them in the spirits. We can't. We can't. Unfortunately, all these characters we can't make two Marth Echo clones because they use different weapons. So we just put them into spirits. <clears throat> um. What else? This stuff I'm gotta be missing. Like just new amiibos. Fucking, I don't give a shit about that. Me stuff. We already knew. They showed us a bit more about it. The hit mode was that you have to, yeah. I was confused about like, you have to buy music, so there's like music that has been unlocked, or can you actually hear it from like the sound test, but not in the game? Or uh, I'm confused about that. And me, that's how you unlock fighters. Well, I didn't say that that's how you unlock them. How do you unlock fighters? He never, he hasn't said yet, so go go learn. He said he mainstream hit, so it's gonna be different at least, unless. Games. Um, <clears throat> maybe it's from spirit mode. That makes sense. If you unlock the fighters from spirit mode. Um, <clears throat> I'm like Smash Four, would just appear, and brawl. There's just like special missions in like subspace, where you unlock them. So, um, what else? Talk about. Land thing, <laughs> he's like get a more stable connection. Well, maybe if you just let me put a fucking land on my switch or came with an adapter, and there shouldn't be an adapter to begin with, then maybe I could, you know, fucking do shit. <laughs> but nope. Fucking then though, dude. My my thing's gonna be wireless this whole time. I'm just like I don't know. I don't think I'm ever gonna get. <laughs> an adapter, unless I like run into one. 
I could barely like fucking get a fan for my room. So I barely I mean I don't have one yet. I, or you know, or like a fucking bookshelf or something. So okay, no doubt for my Nintendo Switch isn't priority. Uh <laughs> um I, Yeah, that's pretty much it, isn't it? Yeah, like I said, I was gonna get the Ultimate Edition like Christmas, so I think I'm gonna start researching that on uh, Ultimate Edition has fighters pass or something. I'll put it in the description if it does or not, or if it just doesn't say anything yet. I'm gonna check because it's been. I think a few hours since this Nintendo Direct was broadcasted. I don't know the exact time it was broadcasted, but. Um, yeah, it sounds like my thoughts, really. It's cool. <laughs> a little, little oofy for me. <clears throat> you know, Japan. Oh, yeah, and then the. Uh, in the video stuff they were talking about, basically, like, don't YouTube it. They'll put it on YouTube. <laughs> we're gonna fucking destroy you. Love Nintendo. I mean, think Kirby's the only one that survives because Sakurai is buys as fuck. I don't know what that. When you're seeing Shulk, by the way, I love Xenoblade 1. And I don't exactly enjoy Xenoblade. Xenoblade 2 is. is it's more of like a <laughs> weeby style. <laughs> it's more. Ugh. What I don't like. It's, a sh- it's a shit I don't like. Like, Xenoblade 1 definitely is like more Japanese. I'm talking about Xenoblade now, but. Quick summary. Um, It's more Jap. I, I mean, obviously, it's, that's Japanese. It's made by Japanese guys, but. That's Japanese thing. Um, but it's. No, it's. It's no like. Ooh, not need my boober. <laughs> or anything. There is romance, but it's very. Every, everyone's very, very uh, mature. Talk very mature, like very British. I'm pretty sure they have all British. All like, but it just doesn't work. It doesn't work. Like, the art style is just so, super fucking weeb. Then there's, I saw some moments where it's like, oh, yeah, that's just like from a shitty anime. <laughs> shitty anime. So. Most part of all, we don't got shock. We don't got rhyme time, baby. Oh, yeah, there's X. I remember when X came out. X is, uh. It looks cool, I don't know. I don't have much of an opinion on it. I haven't seen much of it. Just that it's a creative character thing, so the main like the attachment to main characters are just isn't there already. I'm just boob slider though, so <laughs> yeah. But yeah. Joke was just really fun. Nobody wanted to just so fucking good. When is it coming out on Switch? Uh when are the remastering on Switch? Please, please, Nintendo. That'd be fucking amazing. Please, I need that in my life. And then fix some of the problems it had, because there were still problems. Obviously, it's a fucking Wii game. Um. Um. <laughs> that's it. That's really it. All right. I'm trying to remember now. I don't want to prolong this anymore, which I already am. But yeah, I mean that's that's it. But damn. All right. <laughs> hope you. I wonder how long this is. Probably like fucking almost an hour. Is on. Oh boy. I uh, hope you. Hope you enjoyed. Don't. I got spoiled about the piranha thing. I don't even know. What, I'm gonna check what the spoilers was about now, or the leaks. But the Grinch leaks were the fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna check that out afterwards now. I guess. Um. So. I'll tell you if fighters pass comes with the thing. Hopefully it does. Excessive. I'm probably get the ultimate version, ultimate edition. So and it's physical. That's why. I was thinking of uh, getting the Switch like bundle thing comes with Smash, but that comes with like a download code. So um. I want it physical. I want Switch games physical. Because it's like a fucking whatever. <laughs> it's like fucking Fortnite. <laughs> like fucking Fortnite. Those are only digital anyways. Um, that's fucking, that, yeah, that's fucking it for me.
All right. Um, thanks. Tune in. Hope you enjoy. Those are my thoughts. And um, hopefully this game is good. Hopefully there's a chance while we could be DLC. I just wish it wasn't a base game just in general. But he's probably probably not gonna end up being the game honestly. But hopefully it's DLC. Hopefully Phoenix Ryan's DLC. I feel like that shouldn't be that hard. Come on, Phoenix, like how huh? put Phoenix in the fucking game, dude. Come on. Like all these characters I want in the game just don't appear. Except in the Smash 4. Smash 4 is still like Phoenix, but Phoenix got the got the bone. Got the bone zone, dude. Alright. <laughs> Bye.